turn into gale. Remember that you will prevail. Did you yum? Spins blue shell, okay. Alright. Read the boxes. What's the bonus? Passcodes. Midair. <laughs> okay. Let's see if I can even do the midair. I just want to see if I can. I was able to do this all of once. That's not it. Oh, it's going to be so much harder because of that, too. Ah, uh, whoops. Wait, did that just say Tass? That definitely said Tass. Alright, well, whatever. We're not worried about that. We're gonna do the actual levels anyway. <laughs> okay. I actually need to have my button, or my finger on the right button here. No, that's like a bonus thing. See here, look. You can either enter a passcode or you can do a mid air. <laughs> it's like a mid air into like a P switch jump into whatever the hell that key's used for. I'm assuming you use that to enter a door. Let's actually do the level. You can't jump on fish. So yeah, this has motor skills enabled in every single level, so you can switch between spin jump and mid-air- or spin jump and normal jump. The whole time. Oh no. Mistakes are made. Hey Sezo, how you doing? Huh! I'm dead. Alright, so I just gotta throw the shell right there. How's Smash been treating you? I quit. <laughs> I quit. I'm done.
I'm no longer playing Ultimate. I'm too much of a Salt Lord. Wait, no! I needed that. Oh. Use Palu! <laughs> Probably a good solution to most of the problems I had. Oops, that's not it. Nah, I, just, I, didn't, I didn't find the... Well, I wasn't having fun with the game anymore. I was just getting frustrated with it, so I decided to do other things. So now I torture myself with playing Kaizos. There we go. Coins indicate where you should land, jump, or let go of an object. You also can't switch jumps while holding objects. Okay. <clears throat> I'm glad you're still able to have, fu uh, have fun with the game, though. Instead of losing the K roll constantly. <laughs> oh, okay, I almost got to the end. K roll or Samus, huh? My problem character was Cloud. I had a lot of trouble against really good sword pl uh, sword characters, so like. Anyone that was really good with, uh, say, Cloud or Shulk? I had a lot of trouble against that. Cloud in my local area, so it's it's kind of hard to avoid cloud. Like if I play in the online locals, I have to play a really really good cloud who also plays. Uh, he also plays Lucina and Marth, so <laughs> there's no getting away from it. Lucina, Zelda, Samus, and Pika in New York. Oh, wow. Man, I would not want to deal with that. Also, you can go really far off that spring. Boing. Yeah, I mean, you got the buzz, too. He's playing Steven right now, isn't he? He looks like a really cool character. Last jump's causing me trouble. He can literally just place a wall behind him, so if you attack him, he can just tech and not die. Unless it's untackable, right? Oh. 
He's got some really cool stuff, though. Hey, we got it. One exit down. Oh, we got some, like, Toho music here. This is from Toho 8. Specific, uh, specifically, it's the special stage. All right, what do we got here? Look out for the ninja clan. They cannot be defeated and will kill you if you touch them. When sliding off a slope, only hold down and you'll gain a lot. Okay, I already know that. Blue shell equals spin. All right. Yeah, the uh, better Twitch TV emotes are on. I don't have five head though. I do. I think I have cat jam. Yeah. You gotta land like right on the right side of him. How did I do that last time so good? I got that first try last time. There we go. Oh, okay, I needed to do a regular jump there. I didn't... I didn't do that right. Didn't hold just down. Oh my god, I hate when that happens. This is the one problem with the 8-Bitto controller, is like, just pressing down alone is just super hard. For no apparent reason. Like, if I press down, I'll get like, left or right with it. Shell jump. All right, all right. Have you ever tried anything like this before, Sezo? Have you ever done like any Mario Kaizo stuff? levels and got fucked up. <laughs> Mario Lost Levels is pretty hard to be fair. Like for a, uh, a standard Mario game that was made by Nintendo, it's pretty damn hard. I keep missing that now. How do I keep missing that? Keep missing the shell jump though.
Oh, I got it that time, but I hit the muncher. <laughs> I didn't slow down. <clears throat> this is apparently pretty, uh... A pretty crazy hack when it comes to using like motor skills and some other ASM stuff, so I'm interested to see what the levels will be like. Cause I haven't I haven't seen any of this yet. Like I haven't even watched someone stream this one before. I wish you could make that with just spin jump, but you can't. Go in the door! Er, pipe. <laughs> the pipe is now a door. And the checkpoint's right there. Alright, I got this. Sick. Yeah, that's pretty close. Spin jump because it's blue shells. I needed to let go of uh, grab there. Not bad, that's two down. All right, what's happening with this level? Look out for lasers. If anything touches the red target, the nearest laser will fire. All right, let's see. Oh, okay. So those things are, these things up here are lasers, all right. This. I got this. Oh. Yeah, I need to I need to stay on the left of him until I get closer. Oh. And then do a full bounce. Oh. Oops. That's not a full bouncer. Oh. oh man, okay, so even if there's an enemy on those, 
All right, all right. So I gotta get the Yoshi to eat the guy that was like on the target. Actually, I wonder if I can do that without even slowing down and just like let the laser fire anyway. No, okay, I wanted to see at least. Oh no, I didn't do a full jump. Alright, we're almost halfway there though. We almost made it to the checkpoint. There we go. Checkpoint get! Oh, I'm, I'm timed here. Okay, so I gotta... What is this going to tell me? You have 10 seconds to figure out each of the four rooms. Don't pause or else you'll explode. My God, okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it says lasers everywhere. <laughs> oh. oh, and you gotta do that quick too, okay. Okay, I gotta jump there. Okay, so I gotta like jump again? Okay, I need to hit the top one, then the bottom one. Oh. Oh. That shell wasn't hitting me before, what the heck? Scammed. Oh, and you can't jump. You have to just, th like, throw it. Oh. 
Ow. Oops, I waited. I was supposed to go. Oh man, you gotta enter it quick then. Okay, maybe I can like bonk my head off of the ceiling? To like, get a bit more time to enter the door? Ow. I went too quick. I'm dead. So I want to like... Okay, I can't actually... Okay, I can jump there. I can jump there because I won't go through those blocks. I need to jump just so I have a bit more time. Okay, I'm through. What's happening here? Wait. Huh? Maybe, okay, I'm supposed to maybe get running speed? It's gotta be so quick. Well, no, because the shells should both die, so I can, I can actually probably wait there. Yeah, I can just wait. Okay. Okay, this one I gotta go here first, and then throw this one up, and then destroy it, and then over here. Oh man, that literally like 0.16 to go. Wait, what? Oh, that's so mean. The laser kills the, the fish. Oh no. All right, I got this. I mean, it was kind of my own fault, but I didn't think it was going to kill the sprite for the finish. Wait! I didn't finish fast enough! Oh no! <laughs> you son of a bitch! Alright. I had to finish faster.
Okay, is that fast enough? Four, three, two, one. Okay, I had enough time. All right, that's the third exit. This is from uh, Super Mario Land 6 Golden Coins, if I remember correctly. Wait, what's this about? Tass. Well, I kind of need that. Give me the key. Give me the key. I don't know what I need this for, but I'm, I'm gonna do whatever it wants me to do. Oh, wait. Wait a second. Wait. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I can't do that. I can't do that. That's way too hard. They want me to do a key drop and then open the door with the key. I can't do that. That's way too hard. Do it? I'll try, but... That's, that's ridiculously hard. Oh, whoops, I can't be holding the run button there. I'm gonna do that. Man, even just getting the key over there is hard enough. Ah. There's no way I can do this. Like, okay, I, I gotta show you, like, basically, like, what they want me to do. So, like, they want me to, like, grab the key while I'm on the vine, jump off the vine, and then land on the key as it's falling, and then use that as a platform to open the door. Like, that's so hard. I had it there for, like, a brief second, and I didn't release the jump button. I can't even, like, do it without having the pressure of doing it with the door. Alright, I'll try it, but this is not gonna end well. Yeah, see, I need to grab the key here, too. Like, I need to grab it while I'm on the vine. And then it's like... I jump, drop key... ...while facing the right way. So I'd be like... Jump, drop key, enter door. Yeah, fuck that. <laughs> no way. I'm, there's no way I can do that. That's That's way too ridiculously hard for me right now. We're doing it the 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 proper way, the non-tass way. Oops. I think I need to land higher there. Okay, he lands on that. All right. All right. Oh. 
I bet you anything the speedrun does that. Like, that's probably humanly doable. Good question. What is going on? This level's crazy. I like how there's just an alternate ending or whatever. That probably takes you right to the end. I bet you anything. It's just like, yeah, you can do this, then we don't this level's not gonna be a challenge for you. Just go ahead and go right to the end. Get out of here. of this later. I got, or another task, the speedrun of this. When I finish it. Oh no, I didn't get up there. I should have just held right. It's funny, it says I like, I find stuff like this less aggravating than Smash. Like, I could do this for hours and not get frustrated. For Smash, like, I play like one or two games that just go bad and I'm just like, I'm in a miserable mood. I just don't have the right mentality for it, I guess. Mentality is a huge part of it. Okay, so green blocks get turned into like ones you can jump through after you jump on them once. All right. I needed to go across. Background's a little glitchy. Oh, okay, I need to... Alright, so this time I need to hit these to get them out of the way. Then we go back up here. And then something will happen here, I guess. He still needs to keep going. Oh, dang. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, okay. All right. All right. All right. I like it. That's pretty cool. Ah, uh, there's like invisible tiles there. There's a special tile in Super Mario World that's uh... It's a 1F0 tile. And enemies can kind of like slide on it or like run a, or stand on it like the Koopa was there. Without moving. That's why none of these guys here are moving. Because they're all standing on 1F0s. That's not gonna work. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, it's uh, apparently a slope assist tile. Ah, I just been jumped by accident. Got trolled. There's a fire dude right at the end. All right, it's four. All right, what's happening here? Press L or R to reverse gravity. You can only do this on the ground. Up and down arrows tell you when to switch gravity. Okay. All right. Yo, what is this music? This is so good. Ah! Dude, what is this? Oh my god. This is so cool. I gotta do a speedrun of this. I have to. This is so cool. I like this a lot. I haven't even seen all of it yet. And I'm already like, I gotta do runs of this. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I'm supposed to run forward to get the bombs to go forward first, then go up. Yeah, I got I got to run right to the end of the platform. And then throw shell here. This is sick. I didn't wait long enough again. Guy who play tested this must have had like the willpower of a god times ten. Honestly, like this isn't this hasn't been terribly difficult. It's like it's pretty well indicated too. Like just compared to some of the other stuff I've played already. It looks amazing though.
Oh, I gotta jump normally there. So this is Mario and Austin. Yeah, I played. Uh, I played five hacks now. I played uh, Grandpa World Two. I played Quickie World Two. I've played Akogare. Sorry, I played four hacks. Uh, Akogare, and I've played uh, Invictus. Invictus being the one I just recently finished. And I'd say, I'd say that, like, Grand Pooh World 2 and uh, Invictus were definitely a lot harder than this, but this is really sick. I like this a lot. See, the thing is, is, like, a game doesn't need to be hard to be fun. Even if it's supposed to be something that's supposed to be, like, a challenge. Okay, I gotta jump. Jump, 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 jump. This is definitely throwing my brain for a loop, though. Okay, I gotta do another jump. I see, I see, I see. I get it now. another jump again. Oh. Alright, you can't jump normally like that. You have to, you can only swap when you're on the ground. Only can swap when you're on the ground. I need to wait a little bit longer. I can definitely just do that with spin jumps like I was doing before, though. Might be a bit easier for me. Okay. I think I'm supposed to like hold right there while I'm flipping gravity. That seems like maybe like what I'm supposed to do. I could probably also just like flip gravity sooner. Yeah, because I could do that. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Wait, what is happening? So this platform's got to go pretty far.
Wait, what? Did I actually need to get that thing to shoot? I think I might have had to get it to actually shoot. So I'd get rid of those blocks, maybe? Okay, yeah, I did. <laughs> oh my god. This is amazing. I gotta thank Streiser for recommending this later. Wait, no, come back. Yo, this has been so much fun, Streiser. Thank you so much for recommending this. I'm having a blast. Alright, I don't know how to do this ending yet. Is it like a... Maybe it's like a shell throw? So like, I grab the shell, I, or I kick the shell, and then I flip and then I land on the shell. Too soon. No, this is this has been amazing. I'm going into it completely blind too. There we go, we got it. All right. So that's exit five. Oh. Oh. <clears throat> Don't hold run. Hold down A or B at all times, and I mean all. Yellow shell equals normal jump. All right. No, it's just a spin. It told me to spin. Okay, alright, alright, alright. Oh man, this is gonna be a sick stage, I can already tell. Oh, you gotta do so much jump swapping here. Alright, I gotta pay attention to things that are coming up in advance so I know what I gotta be pressing. I swapped again too soon. Okay, all right. This is amazing. Oh. Yo, actually, I got a question for you, Streiser, because I've already finished the level. In the third level, um, that has the task door, does the speedrun actually do that? <laughs> does the speedrun actually do that? Oh. 
Not to your knowledge. I'm actually so curious to see it now. I want to. I want to know. It's like there's a key that dropped on the left side of the screen, right? And uh, <laughs> it seemed. It looked like you had to bring the key from the left, like over to the vine, and then you had to do a key drop off the vine, land on the key, and then open the door off of the key to do it. Yeah, I might actually run this. This is really cool. I like this. Ah, uh, no, I did it wrong. Wait, no, I did it right. Checkpoint get. Same ordeal, just with a pipe instead of a slide. Try to beat this part one-handed? I mean, I already have kind of been doing that. Okay, spin, 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 spin. Actually, I kind of wonder, could you... This is like completely pointless, so I just want to see if you can... Okay, I, I just wanted to see if you could land on the... Uh, the Prana there. By doing like a low, ju a low bounce. I didn't hold the... didn't hold the button. Oh. Nope, that's not it either. This one's a bounce, okay. That was not very count. to use mortar skills like this? I feel like you're, you're the person to ask on this. Stages, yes, but I don't know of any others that use it for the whole hack. Oh. 
Oh man. It'd be really cool to see a full hack made with like motor controls. Like obviously this, this is a this is a this is a full hack, but I mean like one that's got like a lot of stages. There's so much you could explore with this. Six. No Yoshi. Wait. So I have to get Yoshi off the screen? I'm not sure what's happening here yet. Oh. Okay, no Yoshi passed that point. And the Yoshi eats the shell if you don't grab it. Oh, okay, okay, right. It's supposed to be a jump, I'm just not timing it right. And then you throw it there. I didn't throw it at the right time, but that's fine. No, Yoshi, please. So you throw the red shell to get rid of the other red shell. That's all that's about. I missed. Oh, I need to be big here. Wait, no. <laughs> I need the mushroom. Yeah, it kind of is, isn't it? Wow, Yoshi rude. Through that where the coin was. Ow. Yoshi, please! Oh, we got through it. Oh. 
Alright, it's a shell jump, I think. Then I gotta land on the ledge, uh, edge of that pipe. Yeah, this entire level is like thought out to be kind of like, uh... It's like a combination of like Mario Maker with a flag? And, uh, Super Mario Bros. like with Super Mario World. It's like super neat. Oh, that's just getting kicked. Okay. Not very good at landing on the edge of the pipe. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's dirty. I almost got caught by that too. Alright, we're on seven now. Yeah, it seems like it's a nice little short hack. And the levels are really well thought out. Yeah. I haven't seen any levels that have been longer than two t uh, a single checkpoint yet. I jumped too late there. Oh, something's killing the platform, that's why. Overworld is kind of overrated. It's cool to have, but... I think it's more cool to have if it's open. And honestly, that quick retry is my favorite feature in most hacks I've played so far. It's part of why I'm not really sure if I want to play Dram.
I just don't want to sit through the extra death animation anymore. <laughs> I needed the swap sooner. Yeah, I'm like, I'm sure it's a great hack. Like, otherwise people wouldn't recommend it so much, but... I just don't want to sit through the extra deaths. I find it tedious. Yeah, exactly. Wait, no. No, I'm dead. Oh, I totally just walked onto the death block. See, I probably wouldn't mind so much. Like, is it possible to make Dram have quick retry? I'm sure people might find that, like, Taboo, like add it into a hack that's already been made, but like if I if I could add quick ride, re retry to it, I'd probably play it. I don't know if it's possible to patch it onto Dram. I hope you like control jumps. Don't hold back, just go as fast as you can. All right. Yeah, that's that's what I feel like. Like if it's gonna be a hard level, at least make it so I can get back into the action as quick as possible. Is it distasteful though? Like I just want to experience the hack. I don't feel like me having quick retry on the levels is necessarily not experiencing the same level, you know? Like, I'm still- I'm still playing the levels, I'm just not having to wait. Maybe I'm not thinking about this the right way, I don't know. Like, I obviously don't want to, like, insult the hack creator. That's- that's the main thing, like... I don't feel like a person that made a ROM hack would feel insulted by me wanting to play their levels just without... ...having the death animation. That's literally the only difference, right? I guess some people might find it frustrating because, like, they had to play through it with, uh... The death animations, they're like, you gotta do it too. Oh. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I'll ask Ram how he feels about it. Maybe I could, like, carry that slide. Oh. 
That's probably the best way to go about it. Because then I, like, at least then I know the creator's not going to be annoyed at me doing things that way. Because, like, I'm going to be honest, I'm doing this stuff mostly just for my own enjoyment, right? And I want to I wanna have fun playing the stuff that they create, because these levels are awesome. That's not it. There's a recent case where they modded an old hack to have a custom OST for money. Did, like, the creator not take that well? See, like, it probably, like, at least to me, it'd be in bad taste if I modified their levels. But I don't plan on doing that. Well, at least the crater was involved in it. Yeah, like if I if I was touching the stage design, I could completely understand someone being like annoyed by me doing that, right? Oh, I actually used Yoshi here, okay. I'm so used to just jumping off Yoshi the first second I'm on him. <laughs> well, Barb's is still quick retry, isn't it? It's not like immediate retry where it just does it for you, but it still gives you the option to press the retry button to get right back into the level. That's all I want. I just I just want to have the ability to get right back into the level. I gotta do the tongue sooner. Okay. Mario or Grandpa World 2 have the Mario drop at the bottom of the screen? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it's just like the, the quick retry. Okay, so we have a big disco shell.
Is that maybe like, are you thinking of maybe Grand Pooh World 1 doesn't have retries like that? Shell, please! I'm dead. I almost made it though. I just don't remember there being the like death animation when I played through it. Done too much. Yeah. I still don't mind that because it's like it's still faster than the death animation and going back to the old world and then seeing the Mario start thing again and then getting back to where you were. Oh, we got Ninji now. Okay, all right, all right. Spin jump. Wait, so then how do you get that? Does this level have multiple paths? path? Okay. Oh. Now I was just wondering because there's like a random ass shell there. There's just a red shell just sitting there. I use it. Oh. 
how do I use it? I don't know how to even get to it. Unless that's later. Oh, it wants me to run back. I see. I see. I see the sign now. I see. I get it. I get it. I don't want to do that, though. I'm going this way. <laughs> <laughs> Who needs a shell when you can just peace wish jump? Is Peace Witcher jumping uh, frame perfect in this, by the way? Alright, let me, let me at least see what the intended way looks like. So, grab this, and then you go... You would have to hit that. Actual frame perfect? Okay. Do it again. <laughs> Show off them elite gamer skills that I don't have. The tricky part about it is that you have to release uh, the run button too to do that, or else you grab the you grab the P switch. jump. One more try at the speed strat. Alright. We'll do it the normal way from now on. That'll be like a speed run thing. When I get really good. Not that I can do the shell jump any freaking easier. But I just run at it and don't throw the shell. didn't get in the door. Yeah, going in the building's pretty cool. I like that. Is that supposed to be like, like, how is he doing that? Is it like a pipe that it automatically enters or something? I want to get this one more time. Just one more time. Just to say I can do it, you know? Even though I've already done it once. I legitimately, like, when I first saw this, I thought that was the way I was supposed to do it. I was just like, that's just a random mass shell over there. That's hard. Actual frame perfect trick. Hey, I did it. Door! 
please. I did a spin jump there anyway, so I probably would've died. Wow. I know, right? Do the frame perfect trick, but then can't enter a damn door. my life become uh, I I did a swap instead of jump suck at door so bad. I needed a swap. Wow. And then jump. Wow. Oh, well, I'm still upside down. No, <laughs> that's not it. Yo, there's so much things going on in this, but it's amazing. What is that? Walk. Walking. I didn't walk hard enough. Wait, is that not supposed to... I think I needed to... Okay, I think I needed to be doing... Or holding the jump button there. Whoops. Looks like we're blasting off. Do 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 I mean, think about when Super Mario World was released versus when Mario Maker was released. 
Honestly, it's more impressive that Super Mario World does so many things right. Okay, okay. Yeah, I just needed the whole jump there, that's all. Oops, I didn't swap in time. Like, the game has some flaws, but for the most part, it's like a buttery smooth platforming experience. It doesn't. It really doesn't. Okay, what's happening now? Are those like reskinned thwomps? See, because they kill you when you touch them. I guess you wouldn't be able to stand on them if they were thwomps. Oh, damn, that falls real quick. Yeah, they don't go back up either. Yeah, the palette is something that you would see on the Virtual Boy, isn't it? That's, that's tricky, okay, so... I just need to kind of go... But no, no! <laughs>
I'm really bad at uh, getting a a full bounce off of a ball and chain. Like when it's going up. Or doing it when I want to, anyway. Oh, I was close that time, okay. I missed the Yoshi. Forgetting that block's gonna fall. I need to swap back the jump there. So after I do the bounce, I need to swap back the normal jump before... Before I grab the shell. Checkpoint get.
Ah, oh, dang. Okay. Yeah, thanks, Carjacker. This has been a blast to play so far. Ah, oh, nuts. All right. Let's go. Okay, what do we got here? When bouncing off objects, make sure to neutral the D-pad to get a higher jump. Mario will always face forward in this level to avoid any jank with switching from spin fly to normal fly. Okay. Wait, <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> and Mario's just like, wait, can you run backwards then? <laughs> that's hilarious. All right. And then I got to swap back to normal and fly. All right. Oh, man. I went too high there. Spin jump, spin, spin, spin. Oh, I guess you can actually just straight up like run into it and then you'll spin anyway. I'm not going high enough there. Do I actually need to spin beforehand then? Okay, yeah, I do. And then back to flying here. I'm really bad at flying levels, so this is going to be tricky for me.
So it's two flies, I think? One, two, spin. No? No, it's not. That's, why am I doing normal jump there now? Maybe, okay, maybe it is that. I just need to wait a little longer to switch back to spin. Oh. Maybe I do like one more fly and then I, okay, I, I think it's three flies. It's gotta be three flies. Unless I just go flying way off into the distance like that. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I have to slow down there, I think. Oh no, I want to swoop, okay. Oh, I had it! And then I ran right into the muncher. I don't know how to do this if I don't get like the higher jump there. It's kind of awkward when you don't get like the higher bounce. Okay, I needed to get a swoop. Or actually, no, I can do this with a uh, spin jump. Because there's a platform there. Oh, hello, Saws.
There's some crazy stuff happening here. Wait, no, I'm not supposed to kill that. I'm assuming I have to swap back to flying there. Like normal fly. So like right here, I'd normal fly, grab the shell. I somehow keep killing that. Yeah, so I grab the shell here and then fly, I think. You didn't like this stage? I think it's cool, I just haven't really figured out what they want me to do yet. And it's really easy to hit those saws, just because I'm not familiar with what I'm supposed to do yet. Also, it's really easy to accidentally kill that piranha. How you doing, Strict Luke? Huh. Terms went well? Glad to hear it. Studying payoff? Man, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, and then I throw the shell there, I think. Maybe. This looks awful. <laughs> oh man, this looks amazing. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I might be able to. I keep going too high there. Yeah, so I want to get like a mid bounce off of the piranha. And then I want to do like a dive. I think. Maybe. I'm not sure yet. I just lost my speed. Yeah, I did. Yeah, this seems like I'm supposed to shell jump here. I didn't have it. 
<laughs> I went too far. <laughs> I just saw him just went like, I'm out of here later. That's the end. Okay, I'm close. I'm close. Backwards running is the silliest thing I've seen so far. Like, in the fact that you can fly like that... <laughs> That's so silly! There we go. Yo, what's this palette? Oh my god, okay, all right. Okay, I have to like catch the platform as it's coming back down. Because so many of the levels in this have been really, really good. Extremely creative, too. jump again. It says in big letters jump and I don't jump. Wait no platform come back. I didn't think about the spikes coming back around. Wait, it went up? Oh my god, what? Fawn trolled me. Jack is finally seeing this and he's like, what? I gotta play this. I 
have a feeling I know what Carjacker's gonna play when he's finished Invictus. No, I didn't jump again. jump past that? Like, do I even need to hit that thwomp? Oh. Yes, I do, because he's in the way. Okay. What you done, Stryzer? Oh. No, to be honest, this is like, I'm super glad you introduced this to me. Still not really sure how to do that part yet. Just got 75 bits from one ad? I haven't gotten bits from ads in forever. Like, they don't even offer it to me anymore. Ah, uh, did the stream die? No, stream did not die. I don't think. I just need to jump right up. Yeah, okay. Oh. 
Oops. And I'm not getting this anymore. Shell throw is too late. Wait, what's happening there? Extremely creative. One moment here. This is for introducing me to this. You deserve this. Mark off the level I just finished. I'm not sure if I just marked off the level I just finished or not. I'm not sure if this is 12 or 13. <laughs> I didn't? Okay. Alright, what do we got here? Say your name. Tear hair fur. Or tear her. 
What a name. Are you happy now? That sounds dirty. If I overshoot something, I re-grab too much. Okay. Swap there. Wait, you're 11? Don't you think you're 13 to use Twitch? Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure you gotta be 13 to use Twitch. bad now. I know, right? I just like, I just got a dollar donated to me in bits and I'm sitting like, like if you're 11, then uh, you're too young to use Twitch. <laughs> I just took money from a, like 11 year old. Oh man. How to give back, b b give back bits. Yeah, you didn't do anything wrong, it's just it's the Twitch TOS, like... <laughs> converted, uh, converted the Robux? Is that even a thing? That sounds super against TOS. I mean, more power to you. Like I said, I'm not going to turn down the money, obviously, but... Yeah, take it easy. No, give me that, please. Thank you very much. Oops. I saw blue and I immediately assumed spin jump. It's gotta go the other way. I almost ran, ran right past it. Oh my god, I cannot land on the left of this Koopa. There we go. I gotta find a, a good spot to jump from, like, to make that consistent. Okay, there we go. I got a spot. Right where the beam is here. I'll just jump there. Seems to work.
You know, I just realized I didn't even say hi to you when you came in, Dagum. How you doing? I feel bad now. I said hi to like everybody else, and I didn't say hi to you. Hopefully you're having a good day. You're a permanent fixture, so I don't have to say hi. I always have to say hi. Even if you're here all the time, I still gotta say hi. <laughs> Forgot the follow slot back. Thank you for the follow, appreciate that. Now in, uh, you're two years older, you can come back and be like, oh my god, I remember your stream, Carter. But until then... Wait, no, I got- okay, I have to immediately throw that, I think. Oh, wait, no, I kick it. Okay, I see what I'm supposed to do now. I just have to actually do it. I keep accidentally spin jumping there. Wait, but how? Do I have to like get speed back there and catch up with the shell, I guess? Why did I spin jump? I have this fascination with the A button. No, 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 don't grab it, don't grab it. tricky. Man, how do you do that? Grab the Yoshi, throw it into the blocks. Or throw it into the block that's like on top of the screen. I haven't been able to hit this Koopa part once. Oh, that was close. That was a lot closer than the last couple of attempts.
I'm slowing down too soon, I think, is the problem. it instead of kicking it. <laughs> and then I had it, but then I spin jumped. <laughs> oh. I actually can't get this. Yeah, this is a good song, I like it. I can't get that. What is this? This is so hard. Wait, wait a second. Maybe if I kick it the other way. I think the coin is indicating the way I'm supposed to hit it. Yeah, okay, all right. Can't even beat Donut Plains 4. I'm sure you'll be able to get it with practice. Dude, that's ridiculous. So I have to land on the the right side of the shell. Hit the Koopa. Bounce off of the Piranha Plant. How do? <laughs> Can I grab and toss left? I might be able to. But wouldn't it go too fast then? Because isn't a, isn't a thrown shell faster than a kicked shell? I'll try it. It'll probably work. I think I'm just hella overthinking it. I think I think you got the right solution. Yeah, okay, that's that's how you do it. That's how you do it. Strizer's a genius. Teaching my dumbass how to play Mario. Is this on the OG SNES or the SNES Classic? Uh, this is a ROM hack, so it's, like, not a official game. Oh. I'm currently playing it on an emulator, but you can play this kind of thing with... Um, a Super Nintendo if you have a flash cart. Oh. I have no idea what's going on after that. Oh. I unfortunately don't have a flash cart, so I can't use my actual Super Nintendo for this. stuff for doing it, but I don't have a good enough Super Nintendo controller either. Like, everything except for the SD2 SNES, anyway.
Uh, I'm getting really close. Well, so here's the, here's the thing. Um, one of my controllers is a NBT controller uh, for Super Mario Kart, which basically means it's a controller that can press left and right at the same time. And then my other controller just has like really busted rubber, so I can't use it. So I'd have to, like, rebuild a lot of it. Now, if you could point me in the right direction as to where to look for that kind of thing, then I would be interested. But I don't want to get shoddy parts, is the thing. Yeah, please do. Please send me that. Place buttons on the Guitar Hero controller because the old ones are very sticky. There was tons of glue all over them. Why was there glue on Guitar Hero buttons? That doesn't sound very nice of her. All I'm really looking for though, Strizer, is just like, I want to get my controller... Oh, she was three. That makes more sense. All I really want though, Strizer, is like, I want to have a controller that doesn't have issues where like... You notice how if I press left and right on this, like, right now all I'm doing is pressing left and right. See how I'm getting that up input and that down input? I don't want that. I want one where I can just press left and right and I won't get that up input. Like, it's really hard to not get it. Like, if I slide over the middle of the controller, that happens every time. Unless I'm super, super precise on, like, how I'm pressing. I don't want separated buttons, though. Like, I know that it's possible to have a D-pad that doesn't do that when it's not separated. But they don't make controllers like they used to. <laughs> That's the problem. Oh. Nintendo especially. Nintendo is super, super bad about their new controllers. I don't even want to get started on that because that just makes me upset. It makes me super upset thinking about it. Like, I'm not even talking about just the, um, the Joy-Cons. Like, the Pro Controller. The D-pad on that thing is actually awful. And it gets the same problem that the, uh, the Joy-Cons do after a period of time, too. And they charge you- they charge, like, what? 80, 90 dollars for it in Canada? Thanks for the 10 bits. Appreciate that. Yeah, exactly. And like I said, the, um... You know the same issue with, uh, Joy-Con Drift? That same thing will eventually happen to a Pro Controller as well. And they also have, uh, issues with Stick Flick. 
you know when uh, if you're playing like Smash, you'll know about this uh, especially. But like you know if you like flick your stick left and then like when it's going back to neutral, sometimes it'll over flick and then it'll go back to hit right. The Switch controller is really, really, really bad for that. You wish you could make money just from watching ads? Saving for an Oculus and I currently have $11, but I gave you like a buck in five minutes. Well, Twitch only lets like certain people watch ads. I don't know what that's about. I can't do that personally. Like, it doesn't give me the option to watch ads for bits anymore. I don't know if this is like a Canada thing or what. Which is a good job, though, is, uh, debatable. <laughs> Just a little debatable. I suppose not, but... Ask anyone that tries to make a living off of Twitch. They'll tell you it's not easy. Most people I know that try and make a living off Twitch make less than minimum wage. I'm gonna have to go after this ROM hack though, unfortunately.
Ah, dang, I almost had it. needed to not do a bigger jump there and I had it. I'm so close now. There we go. see there's a uh, looping in this how do I wait what oh I, I can't I get it I get it I get it Yeah, Pog's what all the cool Twitch kids do. I need to swap again there. I knew swap was enabled, but I was like, how do I... I, I, I didn't realize that it was like a... I didn't realize it was a vertical scroll level. Oh. Watching this hurts my brain. Man, you should have seen the level earlier. needed to do a full jump there. <laughs> and then spin jump. Okay, all right, all right. We're making progress. That's a normal jump. This is so cool, I love this.
Okay, and then it's swap and then spin again. Okay, all right. I'm trying so hard to remain PG right now. <laughs> I'm trying not to say any, like, words I normally wouldn't say around kids. Yeah, that's not it. That swap. No, wait, that's not it. Okay, and then I do another jump there, another spin jump. running. I'll come back. I needed to do a normal jump. No! This is so sick. Trying to swap where the arrow's telling me to swap. Didn't seem to work out too well, though. Kind of re grab that a little bit. Can't watch any more ads. Hey, that just means you get to watch content instead.
Uh, just a quick sec. Alright, sorry about that. Laser beam. Okay, I need to like jump there, I think, right away. Yeah, okay, jump. Oh, okay, so I like drop down into the shell and then I do a shell jump. And spin. Dude, this level is insane.
Yeah, music from Toho is pretty good. Ah, uh, dang. It's another re-grab. Grab. Forgot. But I can't re grab right away. Sounds kind of like a castle theme, you think? To me, it kind of sounds more like a final, a final battle type theme, but not necessarily a castle theme. Oh. Random up throw. Spin. And I'm upside down. What does no backseating mean? It means, uh, I don't want people to tell me how to play the game. Some people come in and they'll be like, uh, oh, you should do it this way. But I don't like when people do that. The occasional tip or whatever is fine, but... Some people are really bad about it. I put that into my tags recently because uh, when I played through Paper Mario Sticker Star, someone came in and was really, really obnoxious about it. And it kind of ruined the experience for me. Or not Sticker Star, um, Origami King. Eh, it happens. It's part of streaming. But at least if I have it in the tags and somebody starts doing it, then I have a excuse to be like, Hey dude, I don't want you doing this. Please stop. And if they don't stop, then I can time them out or ban them. Truthfully, like, sometimes when I go into people's streams, I can be like that, too. So, like, I try and be aware of it. But that's just because of the kind of gamer I am. I'm, 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 I'm all about the optimal. So like if, I, if I'm watching someone play a speed run of a game that I know or something like that and I see that they don't know something like I want to I want to teach them but if they don't want help I'll try not to give it to them
75 bits, how does he do it? I keep re-grabbing. I can't re-grab there. At least not until the second red shell. all the bits but maybe you should like save some of your bits for like somebody else or something you know I feel bad okay I don't even know what's happening there You don't know any other streamers that you like? Am I like the first streamer you run into? So how did you run into my channel? I mostly asked because I thought that I had an 18 plus thing on my channel. when you enter it's supposed to be 18 plus maybe I don't have that anymore maybe I disabled it you looked up Super Mario World well, there's usually a lot of people playing this game You got good taste in games. I think I know what I gotta do here now. If you like Super Mario World, um, I'd recommend you try out Celeste. Celeste is another really good platformer. It's on PC and a bunch of other different consoles. I think it's on Switch too. that swap sooner than the arrow actually tells me to, I think. I'm trusting the indicator a little too much. Yeah, I need to, like, drop down, hit that plomp. The spin jump and then bounce off that shell.
Snake's OP in Brawl. He kind of is. Snake and Meta Knight are both really good characters in that game. I think Ice Climbers were really good in it too. As for, as for Ultimate being bad, I don't think it's a bad game. I don't play it anymore though. I'm into the uh, competitive aspect of Smash, so like the story stuff doesn't really bother me too much. That was almost it. Oh, sounds like your disc is scratched. Do I gotta press up there or down there? It's probably... Oh, it's still down. Okay. I tried to press up and I didn't go down the pipe. Yeah, the spikes being animated is really cool. That's a that's an EXGFX thing, isn't it? Smash 4, but the Wii U broke it. That doesn't sound right. Wait, can the Wii... Can the Wii U actually do that? I've literally never heard of anyone's Wii U breaking a game. to your Guitar Hero 1. Yeah, I've just never heard of a... Like, I've heard of discs getting scratched and stuff by a console, but... Never, it like, breaking the disc straight, straight up.
like the only way I could see that happening at least and I'm not accusing obviously but the only way I could see it happening is if like the console got hit when it was running the disc either something was dropped on it or like other things happened I did it again. I pressed up instead of down. That messes me up too much. Huh. I've literally never heard of that happening with a console like that. I think I'm gonna get this pretty soon. There we go. We have a frog. Uh, how does the ceiling mechanic work? Uh, I press L, like, so if I'm standing on the ground, I can press L or R and it'll swap gravity. It's so like I'm on the ground right now, right? But I can I can press the the button here as you see to swap it. idea what's happening here. Okay, I need to go back up. land on the piece switch and I'm going down. And then I gotta... Okay, alright, 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 I get it. I get it. And then I gotta go back up. Funny. Oh, I can actually just run across. I'm a dummy. Did I do it? Bloodied and beaten, Mario walks to the goal without the player's help. Is this the end? The final goal. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> you didn't make it. All right, that's game. I think. Wait, is this an actual level? No, okay, it's not, okay. Let's check out the credits. So the ASM was done by 
Nergagul, Ima Melia, uh, Melia, Noob is Noobish Noobsicle, Noobish Noobsicle, uh, Alcaro, D2. I need that out of the way. D to the fourth. Oh, okay, I see. World Peace, Russian Man, Mario, and Thomas. MD Battlefrog, Louis Doucette, Dark Bloom, Just Kit, Naoi So, or yeah, something like that. Madalandio, HB, HBR Bot, Botna, Botnator, HBR Botnator, Microwave Bro, and Kerr for help. Shoutouts to Ryukar, L Daddy, Pooh Bear, or Pooh Bear, <laughs> Tass aka Doad, uh, Nice Hack Panga, Glitchcat7, Juzzy, and Bleb. Alright, music was. So this is like all the music was uh, titled Super Mario 3D World World Star by Max. Graphics were done by Juggling Joker, MD Battlefrog, and Mario 3 Endu. Yo, hey, Cole. Level 1, Super Mario World 3D World Main Theme by Wakana. And then the level itself was done by... Yeah, okay, so graphics, sorry. Graphics is the bottom one. Hey, if I get them wrong, I'm sorry. I'm trying my best. <laughs> so the graphics of this one were done by the same people as the first level, or the title screen, I mean. Level 2's graphics were done by Gamma uh, V. Level 2 is Toho, History of the Moon by Wakana. Level 3 is Sonic CD, Wacky... Wacky work, Workbench Past. This level's graphics were done by Gamma V and X King. So this, this uh, song was done by Ultima. Level 4, Super Mario Land, Muda Kingdom. Done by uh, the Insanity 115, and graphics are done by Skewer, Skewer and Gamma V. Level five is Super Bonk Twilight Space. I've never actually played Super Bonk. By Masashi. Graphics are done by Lou and Sweet Dude. Yeah, I beat it. It's over. Level six is Delta Rune Rude Buster. Who uh, Pinsy did this? Pinsy did this. Mario Fan 101 did the graphics. Level 7 is Super Mario 64 Bobomb Battlefield. NC did this one as well. Burke did the graphics. Level 8 is Toho, the greatest, uh, greatest salvation. Wakana did the conversion for this. Mix uh, Mr. Pixelator did the graphics. Level 9, Press Garden Zone Act 2 by Gifts Haven. And Fedora Friday and Stan the Stan the Machiar, I think, did the graphics. Level 10 is Stardust Speedway Bad Future by Ultima. And the graphics were done by Foop2164 and Burke. Level 11 is Wario Head Honcho Carpacio by Wakana again. Wakana did a lot of music for this. And graphics were done by Alex No. Level 12, Toho Fall of Fall by Wakana. Graphics again by Mr. Pixelator. Level 13 is Undertale Mad Mew Mew by Wakana again. And Mathos did the graphics. Level 14, Deltarune vs. Susie by Ultima. And graphics by Infrared. And last level, Toho Necrofantasia. Oh, sorry, yeah, Necrofantasia done by Wakana. And Rikon V73 did the graphics for this. What do we got over here? Chain Reaction. 
Thank you so much for playing. The passcode for unlocking the bonus room is... <laughs> of course it is. Wait, how do I get out of here? Wait, is that supposed to happen? Uh, whatever. Okay, let's, let's see the bonus room. supposed to mean like elite. Alright, I want to see the bonus room. mode you either looked up the passcode or beat the game these are the harder remakes of some of the main levels wait what okay so we're not actually done yet then okay so we finished normal mode i mean i beat it but i didn't like beat it beat it there's harder versions of these levels apparently surprised I lived through those bullet bills. Either way, I gotta I gotta take a break for now. Um, I'll, I'll come back and I'll do hard mode either later tonight or tomorrow, one of the two. But I do have to take a break right now because uh, I am expected to be talking with somebody, so I gotta go and do that. Hope everybody had a good time. Um, we're gonna send a raid off to somebody here. Let's find out who we're gonna send a raid to. Jiku's making the level right now. Uh, let's see. Yo, you guys want to be spooked for Halloween? Chapin's playing Alien Isolation right now. We can go check that out. Let me check who's doing Super Mario World first. Wait, 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 wait. I see someone I see someone playing through Invictus. I gotta host that. I have to. Hopefully they're a good streamer. Um and yeah, I will try and be on again tomorrow and we'll see if we can either do hard mode of chain reaction or we can start something new. See you guys then.